Thousands of students, academics and teachers in more than 80 cities across Brazil have taken to the streets to protest against planned government spending cuts on education. It was only on Sunday that uh, pro-Bolsonaro protesters marched in support of the country's leader. Rachel Stanton has this report. Defending education is defending our future. That is just one of the many signs being carried through the streets by these protesters. Across Brazil, thousands of students and teachers have had enough. Demonstrating over the government's plan to slash education spending on federally funded high schools and universities by 30 per cent. This is now the second nationwide demonstration. It's defending exactly what the president is revoking, this issue of budget allocations, because we know that the allocations will directly hit the functioning of the universities. Every country invests in education because it is a strategic area and here Brazil is going down the wrong path. And we see many problems in the universities. President Bolsonaro won the country's election last year. But since taking office, his popularity has fallen in a number of polls. I think education is essential for you to build a better country, for you to put the country forward in every sense, in every area, in finance, environment, in science and technology. If a person doesn't have education, they don't have anything. The Brazilian government claimed these cuts are needed as the country has yet to recover from the economic recession. But the concern of many is far from over, as they feel these cuts could have an everlasting effect on their education. Rachel Stanton, BBC News.